Actor Jonathan Majors and Megan Good might be happy because Jonathan Majors recently announced their marriage. However, everyone is confused by this marriage because of how quickly it happened. Furthermore, there's one more tiny detail about Jonathan having an entire DV case. Everything is going well. Megan is at last talking about her marriage and sharing the reason she got married to Jonathan. So is this a business marriage or are they truly in love? Child, I had no idea that the relationship between Megan Good and Jonathan Majors was that serious. They are reportedly married. And I think I can speak for everyone when I say that none of us anticipated this. After only five minutes of dating, everyone seemed to think that their relationship was a publicity stunt and not genuine. Let me bring you up to date on this tea in case you missed the beginning. Jonathan was detained earlier this year on suspicion of touching Grace Jabari, his girlfriend at the time. Majors became enraged after Jonathan and Grace got into a fight, according to TMZ. He allegedly slapped her after grabbing her hand. At the time, the alleged victim further stated that he placed his hands around her neck and that she was obviously injured, with bruises on her face, redness, and a laceration behind her ear. We believe Jonathan was a nice person who wouldn't hurt a fly, so the allegations took us all by surprise. He was the kind of man that says things like that, you know? It's true that celebrities lie and appear to be someone they're not. But in this case, it was different because people actually liked Jonathan. Thus, it was strange that he would ever touch a woman despite his repeated statements about how much he valued them. However, a number of people who knew him before he became well-known came forward after hearing of his arrest, revealing that he wasn't exactly the wonderful man we had assumed he was. There's a particular actor relatively new on the scene who Twitter has violently fallen head over heels for, who in actuality is a vicious, cruel, abusive human being both professionally and in his personal life, tweeted filmmaker Ab Allen, the first person to comment. And I get crazy every time a new viral thirst tweet about him appears. About a month prior to the accusations made against Jonathan, he sent that tweet. Therefore, he didn't exactly specify who he was talking about in his tweet. However, once Jonathan was revealed, someone requoted Alan's tweet, stating, Now we know who this tweet was about, to which Alan replied, Ding, ding, ding. Tim Nicolai, who worked with Jonathan on Broadway, was the other person who revealed Jonathan. Tim took a more straightforward stance, tweeting, I'm just going to say this about Jonathan Majors and call it quits. For years, many at Yale and in the larger Nicey community have been aware of him. He is an abuser and a sociopath. And that is how almost everyone describes him. It's unfortunate that it took until now to report him. Many, however, continued to support Jonathan and were prepared to give him the benefit of the doubt despite this. But when his attorney made public a screenshot of the text exchange between Grace and Jonathan, in which she stated, they assured me that you won't be charged, things took a bad turn. They claimed that because of protocol, they had to arrest me since they had seen my bruises and knew we had fought. I'm sorry you're in this situation and I'm furious that they did. We'll make sure that this doesn't happen. I informed them that attempting to take your phone was my responsibility. I recently left the hospital. Although the text implied that Grace was afraid of Jonathan, which was undoubtedly the intention, they only served to cast Jonathan in a negative light. Unexpectedly, his public image suffered greatly and he was fired by nearly all of his employers and management companies he was going through a difficult period. You can only imagine how surprised we were to learn that he had become connected with Megan Good. Many things didn't add up and their relationship's history was a little strange. He was dating Grace one minute and then less than two months later, he appeared with Megan and they were talking about how much they loved each other. When Jonathan's entire career was on the line and he could lose everything, everyone questioned how he ever had time to fall in love. One source told TMZ, over the course of the last several weeks, Jonathan and Megan have gotten close, and the relationship is fairly new. Other sources also confirmed that they were dating. There were also discussions about their dates and how much they enjoyed their time together. However, it didn't stick and became seen as a publicity gimmick. All right, so in addition to the entire DV controversy, Jonathan has also been under fire for dating exclusively white women. People therefore believed that he started dating a kind sister like Megan to repair his reputation after he was struck with a string of court issues.
If you're asking why Megan would consent to something of that nature, it was believed by many that she also required some notoriety. She'd been divorced from Devon Franklin for some time, and since then her career had been quiet because not many people were discussing her. Rumors circulated that she was attempting to change her image from the innocent pastor's wife actress to one of a celebrity by courting attention through her relationship. To be honest, that clarifies the types of men she has been associated with following her divorce. She was first linked to rapper Disaster, who happened to be her training partner. According to numerous sources, Meg and battle rapper Disaster are romantically involved. In the beginning, the two worked out together in the Los Angeles region. However, current acquaintances of Meg and Disaster think the two are dating. When Disaster shared images of him and Megan hanging out and lounging, people started remarking about how cozy they appeared, which strengthened the rumors. That essentially verified the rumor. Now that Megan was dating Jonathan, who was dealing with a legal situation, it felt more and more like a publicity ploy to help him improve his image and help her improve hers. But kid, it appears that this wasn't just a publicity gimmick, because Jonathan recently announced their marriage in style. It's also possible that this PR ruse is far more genuine. Although it was adorable when she called him babe, it was his referring to her as the M that made things official for everyone. For additional proof, consider this. Dennis Byron, the award-winning writer and editor-in-chief of the Hip Hop Inquirer who has been covering the Jonathan Majors case, also tweeted, Megan Good Majors, congratulations. It appears that they were secretly married and have been a married couple for some time. Insiders claim that despite having a serious domestic violence charge against him, Megan has been thriving since she started seeing Jonathan since he is all a woman could ask for in a partner. Speaking of that issue, numerous sources have said that the alleged attacker of Jonathan will be charged with assault. Grace allegedly received a summons to appear in New York to face the assault charge, according to Radar Online. They also disclosed the denial of the DV allegations made against the actor by Majors and his legal representative. Furthermore, asserts that Keel Majors was the victim of Grace's scratches and blows throughout the argument. It appears that Jonathan may not be guilty after all. Additionally, it clarifies Megan's decision to wed him by demonstrating her belief in his innocence. Fans certainly had something to say about this. I hope they are together and happy. Some people said, I'm hoping he's content and going about his business. Some, however, remarked, this is obviously a publicity gimmick. It's funny how exactly after Becky made those accusations against him, he suddenly appeared with a sister on his arm. I'm not at all sold on this. What are your thoughts on this, guys? Do you believe Megan and Jonathan are genuinely in love? Or do you think they are just pulling a publicity charade on us? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and subscribe to us for more celebrity gossip. Thanks for watching.